Hi everybody, this is Lainey. Hope you all are doing well. In today's video, we will highlight Hispanic Heritage Month, thanks to CNN. National Hispanic Heritage Month began Wednesday and will run through October 15th. That Wednesday was September 15th, giving the United States an opportunity to recognize and celebrate members of our community and their ancestors who hail from Mexico, parts of the Caribbean, Central and South America, and Spain. The Latino community and Latino history is a fundamental part of American history, says Emily Key, the Director of Education at the Smithsonian Latino Center. Here's why America commemorates Hispanic Heritage Month and what you should know about it. The history. Rather than starting at the beginning of September, Hispanic Heritage Month take place over 30 days starting on the 15th, a nod to the anniversaries of national independence from a number of Latin American countries. They are Costa Rica, El Salvador, Guatemala, Honduras, and Nicaragua. All recognize September 15th as the date of their independence. While Mexico independence is celebrated September 16th and Chile celebrates its independence September 18th. Hispanic Heritage Month traces its history to 1968 when the observance was just a week long. President Lyndon Baines Johnson signed a bill designating the week of September 15th as National Hispanic Heritage Week. In the inaugural proclamation, he wrote of the great contributions to our national heritage made by our people of Hispanic descent, not only in the fields of culture, business, and science, but also through their battles. That was the period for sure when in Southwest Latinos across the country were demanding greater inclusion and representation politically, culturally, socially, economically. Everything, said the professor of history and Latino studies at Northwestern University. It was a demand for greater inclusion and representation and acknowledgement that Latinos played an important role in the United States of America. It wasn't until nearly 20 years later that Hispanic Heritage Week was lengthened to an entire month under President Ronald Reagan. Representative Torres of California submitted a bill to expand it, saying in remarks at the time, we want the public to know that we share a legacy with the rest of the country, a legacy that includes arts, writers, Olympic champions, leaders in business, government, cinema, and science. Torres's bill died in committee, but, but, Senator Paul Simon of Illinois submitted a similar bill that Reagan signed into law. The contributions of Hispanic and Latinos to the United States are long and story. He stated that the first known colony in America was not Jamestown, but the Spanish colony of St. Augustine in Florida. Hispanics and Latinos have fought in every war since the American Revolution. They are business owners, 
veterans, teachers, and public servants, just to name a few. And they are a part of the American fabric. Hispanic Heritage Month is a chance for the country to acknowledge not only the rich history of its diverse Hispanic community, but to learn who they are today. The 2020 U.S. Census shows that Hispanics and Latinos make up a fast-growing multiracial group. In 2020, 62.1 million people identified as Hispanic or Latino, 18% of the U.S. population. That number has grown 23% since 2010. Between 2010 and 2020, just over half of the total U.S. population has grown. 51.1% of, of that growth was due to Hispanic or Latinos per the Census Bureau. This growth is just another reason why Hispanic Heritage Month is important. It is important to celebrate and understand that the Hispanic and Latino community is a large portion of the United States of America. There are a lot of ways to acknowledge Hispanic Heritage Month whether you choose to read a book, look at a film, documentaries, go to PBS and watch a Latino American podcast, just get involved and learn about the Hispanic and Latino history in America. There you have it, a little bit of history on the Latino and Hispanic Heritage Month or should I just say Hispanic Heritage Month. Be well, stay safe, and stay in peace, not pieces. Hit that bell so you will know every time I upload a video. Word of the year, peace, peace. Deuces, see you soon.